Gambia here this afternoon. First row have gone in, second row about to join them. Sloan the Crow at the inside box, the fave. Green light. Lures in action. We're ready to jump here for the running of the 10th. They're set. Ready in racing. Sloan the Crow began well the inside. Pat the Tiger began brilliantly. Went straight to the early leader. So it's Pat the Tiger from No Bob Rob running up on the outside through there in the centre. Grand Warrior followed by Electra Hybrid. Sloan the Crow's back to second last now and last of all one Hombre. No Bob Rob up to the bend led by two. Pat the Tiger railing through beautifully around the corner. No Bob Rob. Pat the Tiger dashed through. Took the lead. Pat the Tiger wins it from... I'd say in second spot there, no Bob Rob, just in front of Lectra Hybrid. Fourth over the line, one Hombre, then Grand Warrior. And Sloan the Crow, best back runner last in. Time was around 23 and 50. Pat the Tiger, number five for trainer Julie Green. Was able to scramble through down on the rail and uh, has shown good track manners to go through, take the lead in the running, and has been too good. So it's five, four, eight will be third, Lectra Hybrid. In 23.53, and that's a PB for Pat the Tiger, 23.61, the previous, now running a 23.53 here this afternoon. Five, four, eight, and seven, one and three quarters the margin. There was a half ahead between second and third, one and three quarters by half ahead. And the numbers are now in the frame after the running of race 10. The winner number five here, Pat the Tiger. In good style, a fawn Brindlebitch by Fernando Bale out of Kerrigan Bale is raced by T. Maynard, a 